Yesterday, packages arrived, and the weather was horrible, so going to pick them up was not a great idea. But I had a 3D printer and a bunch of other cool, amazing stuff, so I went anyway. And uh, I just fought my way through a storm. The storm wasn't so bad, but the waves were crazy. And the wind, and it took me six hours to get there. <laughs> but anyway, I got all my stuff, came back in like two and a half hours, because then I had a tailwind, and picked up a lot of awesome stuff. So here's my boat. And the first thing is I bought a whole bunch of like gymnastics, jujitsu, whatever, wrestling mats. I got, these are used, I got a deal on them. And then a whole bunch of boxes from Amazon. And there are a whole bunch of boxes inside here. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna pull all these suckers out. I need to lay these out in the sun, I guess. They got rained on. Let me see. Ah, not too bad. Ah, they'll dry pretty quick. Oh, I'm really happy about those mats. I've been wanting that kind of stuff for a while. Because I'm going to build a gymnasium in my house, right? So I need... Anyway, all right, let me start getting these boxes out of here. You're excited about the 3D printer? I hear you've been talking about it all week. <laughs> What are you guys doing? Am I interrupting if I actually want to open all these? Yeah. No. I am? Alright, I got a bunch of I got a bunch of this stuff from you guys, so I'm gonna show well, you wanna open it? What's in there? Oh nichrome wire! This one's full of nichrome wire. I've been using that for um, speed controllers for boats and various oh. things. Bubbles are more important. Have fun, Jamie from Liberty Auto. Thanks, Ren. Dude, that's awesome. All right. Wicks. Yeah. All right. You got some wicks. I know these came from Dave. Wicks for a lighter. Where's the lighter? Yeah. There we go. A Zippo lighter. So hopefully this will last a long time and actually be refillable. Whoa, that's pretty nice. Check that out. Got a warning sticker on the back. I don't know. I don't care about warning stickers. Don't. Why is that warning sticker? That's sandals. Oh, help. Oh, get Come on. Come on. Who else would you? Someone do Is this actually. I don't know if it has fuel in there, but no. I gotta put fuel in there. Alright, let's keep this in here for the moment. Thank you, Dave. And they're wicks, and there's also extra flints. Yeah, the, the flints are in here. So if, yeah, I've got enough wicks and flints to last pretty much forever. Hey, hey, don't step on the stuff. I should probably have banned children from this. I can't even move over a little. All right, I got giant sandals for my huge feet. That's excellent. Like I'll get those out later. That's just two two pairs of giant sandals. Wait, there's a third pair that someone sent me. I don't know if it made it on this container though. That's this one. Again, um, you're like standing right in front of the camera. You know that? Okay, this this is a camera, an underwater camera that actually has a screen, so hopefully I can get some nice underwater video with this. I had a, uh, what's it called? <laughs> I've had a GoPro for a while, but it's one of the old ones that doesn't have a screen on the back, so I, you know, I can't see what it's getting until later. Uh, hopefully this will be really good. Don't step on any of this stuff. There, I popped one too. Who is this from, the camera? From Ken. Thank you, Ken. That's awesome. All right. Here, move over. Oh, this is... <laughs> okay, so a while ago, I was talking about, like, emergency food supplies and stuff. And some guy was like, hey, wait, what's this place called? A mountain house. This guy was like, you know, my family gets these mountain house emergency food long-term storage thing. Yeah, this will last 30 years. 
Um, so he told me if I put stop over here. He told me if I put something on my Amazon wish list, he would send it to me. So I put this and something else. And he sent me the other thing, and then someone just sent me this one. Randy! Thanks again, Randy from he's, Yeah, Randy from Liberty Auto, man. Thanks, dude. Can I open this? No, we don't want to open this right now. This is food. It's it's freeze-dried food, so if the world explodes, we can still eat for like three days or something. Well, if it explodes, we're dead. Okay, watch out. What do you got? Oh, I don't know why I want to open this yet. This is a 3D printer. Dude, you keep standing in front of the camera. So this is what my son is most excited about. After I explained to him what a 3D printer is, he's been kind of losing his marbles since then. Um, it's a Sovol SV06. I bought this one myself. And I also have a box full of filaments. Yeah, this box over here. I just found the cheapest PLA filament on, on Amazon. And I got... I don't know, I got 10 rolls of this. So I'm going to get into this later. But check out, check out while it's packaged, it's like shrink wrapped. So I won't have to worry about humidity until I open them. Wow. Oh, you know what this is? <laughs> Flippers that actually fit me. I hope. Oh, I've had flippers that don't fit me for so long. Yeah. Like I put my feet in them. Oh, that is so nice. Oh, that's amazing. So I've, I have huge feet, so I can never find things that actually fit me. But, oh, that is so nice. Like my, my other flippers that I've been using are size 11, 12, and my, my feet are size 14. These are size 12, 13, so it's still... A little bit small, but man, this is totally, totally good enough. Let's see, do we, do we get a special note? I don't know, whoever, whoever sent me the flippers, super thanks, man. Is that oh, little buck? I, don't know. I can't wait to go murder some fish. Oh, I get a headband. Is that a headband? I don't know. I don't know what that is for. Maybe that's to hold my flippers together when I'm not using them. I don't know, let me take them off though. Goes on the boat. I gotta get you guys flippers soon too, don't I? Yeah. But not until your feet stop growing, because like every week you have, you wear different size things. Okay. You could get flippers now. Okay, this box is done. Oh. You guys in the bubble wrap. Oh yeah. Oh, I've been looking forward to this. This is a caliper, like a... Ah, I'll just get it out. Wait, who said this? Ah, this is from Randy, too, from Liberty Auto on YouTube. Thanks, man, that's awesome. Man, Randy's kind of spoiling me a little bit right now, isn't he? Um, How? Oh, he just sent me lots of stuff. Okay. Oh, I love these. These are so cool. So, you know, this is a caliper to measure thicknesses of things. And in the past... Wait, I thought you had one of those. Uh, would, would you let me explain? So, it, way in the past, I had the digital ones that need batteries. And it's super annoying because it works great for like a little while. And then you have to replace the battery. And it's like, well, uh, annoying. So this... Oh, I love this. This has this awesome... Like, look at that. Isn't that so cool? Oh, that's so cool. Um, so I have another one of these that someone sent me, but that one is imperial measurements, which is useful for a lot of things because you buy things and they're often in imperial measurements. But I wanted one in metric, so this one's in metric. So that is super sweet. I'm going to keep it in the bag. And with these things, if they don't have a battery, you know, as long as you take care of it, I mean, it'll pretty much last forever. I mean, eventually it would wear out, but... I'm a great star. That's somewhere good. I need that box. Okay, oh, look, I made a little problem. Oh, nice! 
I know what this is. Uh, this is boat carpeting. And I wanted to get it to maybe put it on... Wait, is this the... No, this is... Yeah, this is the outdoor... Wait, what does it say? I don't know. It's like outdoor... Indoor, outdoor carpeting. Anyway, so... Yeah, this isn't... I was thinking this was the one that sticks down, like you put on a boat and it sticks. No, this is the one that's just like a big... A big carpet. So... Oh, and it's from Vivor. Um, Vivor is just the company. I don't know. Um, yeah, isn't that nice? We can put this somewhere and that can become the Lego zone. Although the Lego zone has been this right here. So is that is that everything? Yeah, that's a bunch more 3D printer filament back there. And, oh, this is so ridiculous. Like, this is the stuff, but look at the size of the boxes. Amazon, you drive me nuts with your enormous boxes and the little stuff in it. Please I open that? At least this, this came in a box that was the right size. We will use the boxes, you're right. All right, I don't know what to do. I'll use the boxes to put okay. Let's clean up all these boxes and maybe get into this 3D printer. Nobody step on this, okay? Nobody jump on this. Well, put all the plastic in the garbage and the boxes we'll use for, I don't know, stuff.